Hey, what's going on everyone? Nick Sapinero here once again. Not from the Divi offices this time, but still here to give you your weekly development update. So I want to quickly apologize for not being around so much last week. I was pulled out of town for some unfortunate circumstances, but I am back and we've had an extremely productive week. I'm really excited to share all of it with you. So let's start with the new hire. Uh, Yura Oleksashin just joined our team as the lead blockchain engineer. He's extremely proficient with proof of stake coins. He has a lot of experience with PIVX and Dash. Of course, a lot of you know we've forked PIVX initially. Um, and he's got a lot of experience with just C++ and he's been on a couple other blockchain teams. He actually did better on the technical interview than anyone we've ever interviewed. So we're very excited to have him on board. He will be added to the site next week and he will add his add Divi to his LinkedIn profile. So before you ask, the answer is yes. <laughs> so we will be moving a fair amount of bugs from development into beta testing this week. We've updated the block rewards and masternode reward distribution to be much more in line with the wiki and the white paper. We fixed a bug that caused compilation errors on certain systems due to OpenSSL. We fixed the bug where block times were a bit inconsistent. So block times are much closer to 60 seconds on average now and they're not being minted from the future. Additionally, we fixed some methods in the blockchain that relate to connecting blocks and stake hashes. So although we closed a lot of bugs this week, we still have some in the core that need to be fixed before we're ready to launch. The first of which is a mnemonic seed phrase. So as a lot of you guys know, we forked PIVX initially and PIVX doesn't have mnemonics in their blockchain. So we need to add one so that you can easily recover your wallet should you lose your computer or break it or what have you. Additionally, we need to fix a bug that causes transactions to be invisible to the entire network, except the two counterparties that were involved in the transaction. We also found the source of a bug in the GUI that caused issues with staking, and that'll be closed in the next couple of days. There's a bug that causes larger transactions to sometimes be broken up into smaller bits. We'll be fixing that, as well as improving the lottery block protocol in order for it to be more efficient and cause less load on the overall blockchain. So, final update. Michael, Jeff, and I are headed to New York City this week for seven days, and although we're not going to be there for media purposes, Krupp Communications has graciously offered to set up some office space for us in their building so that we can continue to work the entire time we're there. So the reason we are going is because we've been in discussion with a few different partners and new advisors for the company over the past few months, and the time has come for us to meet with them in person and hopefully close the deals. Now, I can't say too much about these deals right now due to NDAs and other legal stuff, but if and when they close, I guarantee you guys will be the first people to know. We're also very excited to go to New York because it gives us an opportunity to go over some business development stuff, tech development including Lithuania, business processes, etc. all in person. We rarely get to meet all at once as a complete unit in person, so we're really excited about that. And if you guys are in the New York area, feel free to hit us up on Telegram or on Discord and let us know and we'd love to meet up and grab a beer with you guys. I've met with a few of the community members myself and I know Jeff and Michael have as well and it's always a good time. It's always great to get to know each other in person and since we're all in this together, right? So that concludes this week's video update. Check out the link in the description. We have an AMA page open now if you guys haven't already checked it out. Go to that link, ask your toughest questions and I'll be answering them on video in two weeks. As always, find us on Telegram, Discord, Reddit, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, your favorite social media. We're there. I'll see you next week.